Hello, a bit of an update on the avionics upgrade as uh, part three of the project I think we're up to. Uh, the panel is in the process of being disassembled and uh, you're gonna get quite a shock because it's quite the mess at the moment. I'll turn the camera around and we'll have a look. So rather shocking looking with bits pulled out everywhere. Um, so the instrument panel is obviously gone as well as the overlay. Uh, that's the structural panel there, so it uh, it stays put, and the uh, radio stack is sort of half out. Some bits are, are gone, um, but we also are now able to remove the vac system because the vac instruments are going to be replaced by the two seven fives. So that'll be a weight saving and also a, a maintenance saving down the track. Um, so I'll show you where the vac pump is that gets removed. So the vac pump is that fella there and it'll be removed and blanked off there and an engineering order to say that we've uh, removed it in accordance with some instructions and what will also go will be this hose that goes in there to our suction gauge our uh, di and our ah so a little bit of weight saving something less to service down the track so all in all a uh, a good setup, but yes, quite a lot of work, quite a lot of things that are being removed. So, here's some of the many removed bits. Um, very sad that the ADF's going, so no more NDB approaches, which is God's own approach, but uh, I have come round with the times and decided to do away with the heavy old NDB, as much as it still was working perfectly, which is kind of cool. So here we have the plastic overlay, which all the Cessnas came with, and uh, they do tend to crack, although this one actually was well looked after and stayed in pretty good condition. And you'll see on that, that's where they uh, originally had the, um, had the panel lighting, so the wiring there for the little post lights, which are those ones there. So that's all gonna get replaced, the new post lights, and uh, hopefully that'll work a bit, uh, a bit brighter. And then over here we have the panel that's, uh, that sits behind that plastic panel. So plastic panel is literally just a, a cosmetic thing aside from being a, somewhere to support the landing light, oh, the landing lights, the post lights. Um, but then this one is going to be recut to um, remove some of these holes. So they'll just be nice and neatly blinked over because uh, there was a NAV1, NAV2 CDIs there, which of course will both be put onto the uh, onto the 275 there so there'll be a few things that won't be recut in this and just make it nice and clean and uh, and blanked the uh, engine instruments will still all go here that'll stay that can go because that's the suction gauge which we're not going to have anymore because of the back pump being removed um, but uh, very excited now to see it actually starting to uh, starting to be worked on. A little bit scary with the amount of stuff missing on it at the moment, but uh, it'll all get put back together eventually. So thanks for watching along and uh, we'll update you in a future video.